On a bright blue October afternoon, Santa Clara County Sheriff Lori Smith came to the Cupertino Community Hall to watch two employees graduate from a county leadership academy. She mingled with municipal officials from around the county, listening, speaking, nodding, her eyes focused, her lips pursed. As the event got underway, department heads came up one by one to present certificates to their graduates. In a way, the sheriff's office delegation stood out from the others. It was a majority women. I just want to say thanks to the sheriff, the undersheriff, Assistant Sheriff Perry for all being here. A similar dynamic was evident the next morning when Smith attended a meeting of the anti-gang task force convened by San Jose's mayor. The sheriff sat quietly, taking notes and sipping coffee. She was not the only woman in the room, but she was in the minority. A lot has changed since I've been employed in the field. When I first was hired, a woman couldn't even take the test to be a deputy sheriff. Um, women weren't allowed to be in that field. Instead, she was sworn in as a deputy matron. 25 years later, she became the first woman in the state to be elected sheriff. Did you say first female sheriff in the state? Yes. Ah, okay. County Supervisor Mike Wasserman was surprised to hear of the sheriff's distinction. Other peers were aware of it, but said it's hardly relevant to her department today. Um, I think externally um, it's perceived, you know, and it's not perceived, it is, it's still predominantly a male profession. There's only, you know, three female sheriffs um, in, in the state. Um, so, but I think the public has a, a stereotype of what a, a sheriff is. You know, in today's work environment, it's, uh, it's just uh, accepted that whoever is in office has earned that position. Voters seem to agree. In 2010, Smith was re-elected with nearly 63 percent of the vote. She's already planning to run again in 2014 for what would be a fifth term. I'm Jessica Parks reporting for the Peninsula Press, a project of the Stanford Graduate Program in Journalism.